Hi kiddos, this is Mrs. McHugh with a quick tip on how to get the Scholastic Book Fair app on your iPad. This is important because you are going to need to have the Scholastic Book Fair app in order to create your wish list this year. So to begin, we're going to click on self-service and your catalog will look a little bit different than mine. You're going to need to type the word Scholastic in the search box. And make sure that you get the Scholastic Book Fair app and not any other app. You're going to click install and once you've clicked install, you'll see that the app is on your home screen. Go ahead and give that a tap. It's really important that you allow the camera um, when the prompt comes up, you're going to have to say OK to allow access to your camera. Down below, you'll notice the red start scanning button. You're going to give that a click and there's that camera access. Go ahead and hit OK. Now we'll click next and it's telling you to point your device at the book cover and then you can start to explore. So these are the three options that you'll receive. We're going to use scan cover. Once I click on scan cover I now am going to hold my iPad up above so that I can see the whole entire book cover. Now it's telling me all the information about Wings of Fire 2. It tells me the author, ages that the book is recommended for, grade levels, and the price. If you look down below, there's an I. If you tap on it, it'll allow you to read the blurb about the book. Some even have a play button on the top corner that will allow you to watch a book trailer, which is pretty cool. I really love this book and I've already read the first one, so I want to add it to my wish list. So I'll push the blue add to wish list button and it's already in my wish list, just like that. Something else that's pretty cool, if you look at the bottom, it says you may also like and there's additional books below that you can click on. If you're all done on this screen and you want to continue scanning other book covers, just click the X on the top left. Once you do that, you can simply scan the cover again. Now, on the very bottom, you'll notice that there is a number one where it says wish list. I can click on that and see that the book that I want is here. Something else that's pretty cool, I know a lot of you think that the book um, Smile and Sisters is pretty great. We don't have the book Sisters at our book fair, but that doesn't mean that you can't get it. Down below, you'll see a search button. All you have to do is click on search, and it says in addition to scanning books for information, you can also use the app to search for books. So let's get started. Up on the top search, I'm going to type in Sisters and go. Let's see what comes up. Well, the top two aren't it, but there I see it. There's Sisters. So I definitely want to get this book, or at least add it to my wish list so that everyone knows that I want it. So I can simply click Add to Wish List and click the X. And now if I look at my wish list, there's two books. If you change your mind about a book, it's not a big deal. All you have to do is click on the quantity and click the down arrow, and it says, Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I want to remove it and just click and it's gone. Something else that's really cool is this is a great way to show moms, dads, aunts, uncles, and even your grandparents which books you would like. So if we don't have a book at the book fair, you could still actually buy the book. Pretty cool, huh? Let me know if you have any questions about the wish list. I hope you have tons of fun at our book fair and I can't wait to see you all soon.